Okay, so this is a burr oak, Quercus macrocarpa. So macro means large, large, carpa meaning fruit. So large fruit. So this guy right here, I'll try to see if I can get a little bit better lighting. Quercus macrocarpa, burr oak. Um, this is a fire adapted species. It has a tremendously um, wide range, lots of different habitats it can live in. It's a member of the white oak group. So notice it doesn't have any points on the ends of the leaves. Um, it usually has this kind of pattern where it has um, kind of some lobes on the end and then it kind of has an open space and then it has a few lobes farther back. Um, but there's a lot of variation. Uh, the main, th one of the things that identifies it are the twigs, which are super thick and they usually have these kind of lumpy growths on them. My camera will actually focus here. But the big thing that it has are really large acorns. It's absolutely huge acorns. I swear. So if you look up there, right there, that is actually the burr oak acorn. It's pretty good sized. Um, probably about the size of, sometimes almost the size of a ping pong ball. So really good sized fruit. Um, this one's not mature, but it usually has some fringe on the edge. Uh, the only thing that looks kind of similar to this is uh, swamp white oak, um, but the leaves have um, less pronounced lobes and the leaves also have white backs to them and they, the acorns also aren't as large. And they don't have the super thick, zoom back out. They have these super thick, hefty branches on burr oak that you really don't see on pretty much any other oak.